Hello, you're watching Big Red Journeys, and on today's journey, we're here in Legoland, California for the summer block party. <laughs> Making our way over to uh, Lego Movie World, we're gonna catch up Benny and the dance party. But before we do, this is the main stage, the front stage at the beginning, where the awesome suit crew we missed their performances for today. But I'm gonna insert some footage from the last time I was here, show this cool group. And as well as DJ Brick Beats is gonna have the dance party from 6.30 to closing right here at the front stage. Pretty cool, listen to some techno beats, dance your heart's delight. So I'm gonna show you about as much as I can today. Uh, some of the things that are here for the block party, they're actually ones that are here year round, but then there are some new shows, just like the, uh, the kickoff show towards the end, uh, DJ Brick Beats, the pirate jig, and of course, Go Extreme, that is new for this year. So we are going to show you as much as we can, but things like Benny's Dance Party, that's here all year round. But it's still a fun show to see. So let's catch a few minutes of it. So if I haven't already mentioned it already in the video, we are here on Father's Day, Sunday, June 18th, uh, 2023. Hence why I'm also wearing my Padres Digi Blue Camo with the Father's Day jersey and hat from a few years back. But anyways, the park has been pretty good. I want, I, you know, a lot of people also ask me like, how is it on certain holidays or like days when like Mother's Day, Father's Day, things that you will have for like, let's take a whole family out for a trip. So far, it has not been too bad traffic wise i haven't really checked on the rides i will do so a little bit later but traffic wise is not terrible it's been pretty good but right now we are on our way over to castle hill because we're going to go check out once upon a brick a new update they've done the show before a, there was the christmas version once upon a brickness um, but this one is a updated version of that one for the block party and there's actually two versions of it there's one where the character is the king and one that the character is a unicorn. I want to see the unicorn one. So we're on our way now to Castle Hill to try to catch that stage show real quick. Also speaking of new shows, here in front of Pirate Reef and Splash Battle is where we're going to have the Pirate Jig Show. That's brand new. Show times are 2, 3.15 and 4.30 for today. We'll be back a little bit later to catch that show. It should be somewhere around this area. So like I said, there's actually two shows of one's upon a break we got the tale of the king that's at one o'clock at three four five and the one we're about to catch the 2 30 showing of the tale of the unicorn knight i don't know about you but a unicorn knight sounds a little more fun now in order to retrieve this golden brick he would need the most brave and honorable knight in all the kingdom so he called upon the unicorn knight to fulfill this dangerous mission everyone is up so the unicorn knight and squire and re traveled through the volcano dodging swinging axes Whoa, watch out you need it. Whoa, a treacherous creature it's on my face. Oh, 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 it's on my face. rising lava here we go If you want to retrieve the golden brick, you must defeat me! You 
fools! You will never win, but I'd like to see you try. <laughs> Start with the block! Uh, and then a slash! Whoa, where is this power coming never from? Uh, oh, push away! Oh, you will never Nine win! Disarm! You've done it! You've defeated me! You have earned the magical golden brick! You truly are the most honorable knight in all the land! Well, that was a hilarious show. Uh, that, that was funny. I'm glad I picked the right one. One is I actually talked to one of the model citizens, and he told me that if you've seen the King show, uh, the one with the King, it's the same one that they've had for a long time, but the Unicorn Knight one, that's the new one. So I'm glad we ended up choosing that one. But you know what? It's a great show overall either way, so it's definitely worth catching both of them if you have the opportunity. You know what? I think a good gauge for today to see how busy it is is to see the Dragon Coaster. Now, the app says that the wait time is about 25 minutes. But let's take a look currently at the line. Yeah, based upon what I'm seeing here, that is a good, probably a good solid 25 minutes, if not maybe even closer to 30. Usually it's about 10 minutes when you get to just like one or two of the turnbacks. But over there, you're adding about another 15 minutes on there. So now that we saw the show, got ourselves a nice little snack, went to a smokehouse barbecue, ended up getting a sweet tea and some chips. We're gonna head back down over to see if we can catch the two shows, the swashbuckling pirate jig or go extreme the new spunt uh, stunt spectacular show that's here for uh the block party and you know what this is a good gauge for today how busy it is passing by through deep sea adventure 35 minutes according to the app and it sticks out all the way out to there uh that's a little bit more than 35 minutes there's a slow loader the queue line is not terribly but i mean all of that back there is full it's a slow loader uh, granted, they do fit like about 12 or 14 people inside each submarine, but not, not for me. Also, though it is better, if you've ever ridden Nemo Submarine Adventure at Disneyland, if you're not one of the first ones on there or later in the day, it gets a nice funky smell in there from all the bodies and humidity. Same thing happens with this ride. So if I ever go on this ride, it's usually either first thing when I get here or later in the day. It just makes for a much more enjoyable experience. The swashbuckling jig is about to actually start here in a couple minutes, so I got a prime spot right here in the front. Arr! Ahoy, mateys! I play Reef Captain! And I'm first mate Starbird! And I'm first mate Port! No, Port, you're the second mate, everyone! I'm second mate Port! Hey. Nice job, uh, my friend! I can it out there oh, yeah, we got some pirate dance go. moves going on! Hey. I love it! Ah. Alright, my friends! The final thing that we need to know in order to be pirates is digging for treasure. So get your shovels out, find an X on the ground, and start digging. Nice. Throw that dirt over your shoulder. Oh, over my shoulder? Yeah. Oh, I'm so oh, you sorry. Got dirt. Dance. Nice job. All right, everyone, put your arms out and dance like you're walking the plank. Whoa. Whoa. Can you wobble back and forth? All right, we got to freeze on one leg. Well, isn't this the scurviest bunch of sea dogs I've seen on this side of the Hey, all right, all right, all right. Oh, terrible. How you doing, Captain? You doing very well? Very good, sir. Very good. I've been seeing your swashbuckling jigs going on here. It's been lovely. Very light on his foot. No, no, no. He's missing one. That's okay. That's okay. But you know what? Something that's also nice and light is a couple of pirate jokes. How about some pirate jokes? Lovely, of course. Of course. So, what is a pirate's favorite letter? Favorite letter? Uh, I could not. Yeah, you would think it'd be R, but his first love is always the C. But you know what, when you get tired with these pirate jokes, sometimes you just need to take a little vacation. Do a little R&R. and r But you know, I, I ultimately did have a question though for the captain, because he would know. Why is being a pirate so addicting? So addicting? Because once you lose your first hand, you're always hooked. Oh! Yes! <laughs> there it is, perfect. Okay. 
Well, that was the Swashbuckling Jig. That was actually a very cute show. I like the music. Like, you know, uh, they play that one that Sea, Shant that sea Shanty song has been, you know, very famous on like TikTok and Instagram in recent times. Uh, and, and then even when they did Shake 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 Casey and Sunshine, Sunshine Band, that was actually pretty fun. I enjoyed it. It was a great show. And I love seeing little shows like that where you just got like some character, dancing, interaction, like Benny's, uh, you know, dance party, things like that. I love those types of shows because it adds energy it adds uh, obviously value for you for when you purchase your tickets you know it doesn't have to be big productions like go extreme or anything like that but just character meet and greets dancing things of that nature that's fun and that's what i love about legoland to have things like that we're gonna go catch go extreme at this last performance at five o'clock but right now we're gonna go to the four o'clock which is the first showing of the legoland block party summer jam that's gonna be in the uh, grassy area near the mainland usa and it's kind of like where they have a dancing, singing. I know Lego Rocker Guy is going to come out there. And I believe also Lego Banana Guy will be there as well, too. Um, but it's a brand new show for the Block Party Summer. So I'm excited to go check it out. Like the little logo characters they put on here. Look at that. Especially this guy right here. Reminiscent of like Evil Knievel. Today, we are holding an audition to find the next awe-inspiring act for my hit TV show, Joe Extreme. I'm so glad you're all here because your reactions will be an important part of the decision making. Now, it's time to introduce you to our celebrity judges. He's a former stunt performer and the only one to attempt a double backflip with ants in his pants. It's Beachbag Stay Mutant! <laughs> yeah! What's up, everybody? <laughs> hey, homies! This is Joe Extreme, right? Well, I'm ready to see if anybody has moves more gnarly than mine. Happy Father's Next Day, up. Dad! She started her own line of cell phones for cats and has two million followers online. Here she is, LOL Leah. <laughs>
And of course, you get to meet the crew afterwards. Everyone did such a wonderful job. Thank especially you, especially Mike over there. He did a wonderful job. I love him. He, 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 he bounced above everybody else. But anyways, I did have one joke for you guys, okay? Okay, so what happened to the knight who wanted to become a stuntman? Well, he changed his name to Medieval Knievel. Oh. <laughs> I'm done with that one. Yeah, I used to go by that. Yeah, I used to go by that. It makes sense. Yeah, hashtag Medieval Knievel. I know I say this all the time. All the shows here at Legoland are just superb. You know, they're, they're all can't miss. But when I mean it, I mean it this When I say it, I mean it this time. That Go Extreme show, best show I've ever seen at Legoland. I want to see more of those types of shows. I mean, yeah, it was extreme, it was cool. Those performers are amazing, I'm telling you. Uh, but it was such a good show, the song. I mean, that, that you know, Legos, they got those catchy songs that get stuck in your head, you know? It, but that song right there, whoa, hey, oh, hey, oh, let's put on a show, hey, oh, hey. I mean, that's a good song, I love it. So, anyways, that's the show to not miss. Well, after meeting Lego Pirate Captain and his scurvy crew, it's time to go on one final journey. Oh, yeah, muchachos, keep playing. Oh, I don't know if you can hear this, but they're uh, they're playing uh, they're playing the final countdown. One of my favorite songs. Good job, guys. Keep up the good work. But anyways, like I was saying, we're gonna go down to now the beginning because there at the front stage is going to be DJ Brick Beats. He's going to be playing the music and playing the night away so we can dance, have a good time, uh, and just have just close off this great day here at Legoland, specifically for all the stuff you can do during the block party. It was a fun time here. And this is stuff that's going to be going on throughout the whole summer. Hours may vary depending on the day, but it's very nice. Um, and you know, lots of shows, lots of entertainment. There he is! Bye-bye now.